Alright guys, so in this video I'm just going to show you how to add some of these cool um, little bumps that go along uh, the edges of the shell. And it's definitely something that you see uh, on crabs. So for this particular creature, this works great. I kind of want to add a little bit like right here. So all we need to do for that is come up to stroke. And I'm just going to dock this palette over to the right so I don't have to keep coming back. And I just do that by clicking that little power looking button. And then we're going to come down here to where it says lazy mouse. And what we're going to want to play with is the lazy step. So on our standard brush, if we come down in, uh, in size a little bit, let me bring up the intensity. You can see what's happening with the um, lazy step being all the way down to a value of 0 0.25. It's just the, the spacing in between the brush is so, uh, so small that you don't really see it. It just looks like one continuous line. But if we make this a bigger lazy step, which is basically the spacing, let's see like how it looks at a three. It's, well, that's a little too uh, far apart it's kind of hard to tell what's going on so let's just bring that down like a 2-2 there you can start to see it bring it down a little more like a 1-5 and that's looking pretty cool so let's just make our intensity a little bit bigger again I want yeah I really want to be able to see it okay that looks good so let's zoom in a little bit here actually first zoom out I just want to make sure I have Symmetry turned on, so tap X. Yep, now it's on. So I can zoom back in. And let's just, let's, I'm going to play with the size a little bit because I kind of want over here, I want it to be a little smaller. I'm going to make this intensity a little bit bigger still. And then I'm going to bring my draw size up by two. And bring it up again. Uh, that looks a little too big. Let's go down one. And then I'm going to just go down one again. And maybe one more. And that looks really cool. So with not a lot of effort, you know, a couple clicks. And then you're able to draw something really cool like that, um, which added a, quite a bit of neat detail to this model. Let's zoom out a little bit and take a look at it from a bit of a distance. Yeah, I like that a lot. I think that looks really cool. Yeah, that little bit of detail really helps them. All right, so I'm going to uh, stop this video here.